Okay, so as part of being super fan, we're gonna let you um, name an item uh, that's gonna be just all for you. And I would suggest going with something that you know will be uniquely yours and personal for the rest of your life, right? That this mm -hmm. is some cool thing. So uh, what we've done is we've written this basically this Excel file that has all the properties of all the items in the game. And with this, we can change all sorts of stats about an item. So I'm gonna select this item. This is the item that we're gonna have you rename. And a lot of just the basic stuff is just right here. Like, is, like even just this right here, like, yes, is it even in the game? Yep, that's in the game. And here's what it's called. Here's the rarity, the level that it starts off. Here's how much it would cost to buy it in the game. Um, here's how much damage it starts off doing, all things like that. This is every item in all three of the games, so there's 760 items. It's so crazy. Like, mm -hmm. that's insane. Um, but today we're going to work on this one. So why don't we start with what you want to call it? All right. Well, um, my mom suggested to me that I should do a thing that sort of relates to our name and stuff because it's a unique name. And, totally. And uh, it's not something that would stand out. So I as think it should just name, be so. Grant. No. Yeah? No? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, her suggestion was no mercy, and I'll probably have to take her up on that. No mercy. Okay. So no mercy, just like that? Yes, sir. Okay. So we'll try that. So here, again, let me just show you. So I have the game I'm kind of running on here. This is where we set up everything. So my temp name in there is I have the Lunar Blade. Um, and so and I have it. In, in addition to letting you name it, I'm going to let you tweak some of the stats if, you, if you'd like. Um, <laughs> So I know that people definitely move towards the, uh, you know, just having more slots available and having them be able to pump mm -hmm. out to the star slots more quickly. So whatever would be best to cause that would probably be the ideal setup on that. Okay. Well, I can definitely do that. And, and that closes down. Here, I should see if I can show you. And it starts to export this file and it runs through this, um, this code that basically takes that and converts that Excel file into a bunch of these uh, INI files, it splits out all the properties, um, puts them in the correct files, and then once it's done, it opens this back up. Wow, and then amazing. if I, so it you know, says Lunar Blade now and has them like this, and if I rerun the game, it should just work. So I'm gonna my handy cheat code, it gives me everything. And now, in here. Oh, that guy's coming back. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, yeah it's cool. Um, so now I'll say no mercy. Do you like how that looks? Do you want to change anything? Do you want like not to have a space or? Yeah, it looks you, good to me. It's good. I think it looks beautiful. Mm -hmm. So that's sweet. I think everything looks good. Yeah, it's okay. great. That's awesome. It's a good choice. Thanks. Yeah, I love it. I think that's totally sweet. That's, that's like awesome. it's cool it sounds cool it fits the fiction it's totally custom to you like good job totally. that's totally mm -hmm. awesome